They know who they are. They know who they care about. The Landons are about family. That's their core. That's what they're about. Both my mom and my dad grew up in, in very similar families. He recognized pretty early on that my mom was a really special person. It was just the greatest privilege of his life to get to work for his dad with his brother. The bank really became an engine for them to make a considerable difference in the community. They're a really humble community bank reinvesting in our community. That's kind of cool. They're a great, fun family. My parents have this real commonality in classic rock. I honestly think that was one of the things that brought them together. He and Diney make a great pair. He doesn't need to be the visible person. That's not who Jim Landon is. When she married Jim and moved to Omaha, even in her early days, you knew that she was a very capable individual. When she walks into a room, she lights it up. And everybody pays attention, even her kids. We weren't perfect kids. She had a real expectation for us. So if you, if you disappointed her, it was, was a really bad day. My dad's really conservative by nature. My mom's probably a little more of a risk taker, buying uh, air rights and starting radio stations, starting a magazine company from scratch. They learn about a need, and then they're all in. In 1975, girls were absolutely a second thought. Girls Inc. was a natural fit with Mary Landon, Jim's mother. The impact of working with these young women and how they could become part of the community, Mary and Diney could see that. Mary went on to the national board. When her time was passed, Diney picked up the torch. My dad was really involved in the Salvation Army and continues to be. And that goes back to his grandfather. They've encouraged others to get involved and get more involved in the United Way and get your friends involved and get your employees involved. It's that founding principle that everybody's your neighbor. Everybody deserves, you know, a real chance to have a really wonderful life. Project Harmony is a good example. Diney was on the original board. Project Harmony at this point in time is one of the top organizations dealing with child abuse in the entire country. We do more for children across the state than almost anything else. They're driven by impact and by leaving this world a better place than it was when they got here. The family started a foundation. It's called the m, &M for Mary and Mickey Foundation. What Diney and Jim have done is they have created another generation for Omaha when those children have their children because they have learned this. We're going to get value from Jim and Diney's dedication to Omaha for generations to come. That's what the Landons do. They're always looking for how do we make this a better place? And then they bring everybody else along. Just get out of their way they'll accomplish great things.